Giovanni Brady here, J Talk Sports here at the National Premier League. As I did promise you guys, uh, second leg quarter finals. Two very enticing games. Basically, the return leg, even though they play at the same place, so it's not like I get any real sort of you know, home and away advantage. But first match, Humble Lion beating Harbour View 3 2. You know, I never really expect that to be honest with you. Harbour View started that game very well, but Humble Lion come out in the second half. Well, they equalized late in the first half and then come out in the second half with a piece of verb. Let that game 3-1 and Harbourview look like they were going home but Harbourview found that one goal so Harbourview now through to the semi-finals uh, second game I to begin between uh, Dumby Hole and uh, Mount Pleasant 1-0, all. all to play for in that game but you know, wait there provide some coverage, talk to the athlete and talk to the coach them uh, talk to some other people who miss about the place and yeah, stay tuned Staff looked a little bit one sided but just exploded into life. This the second one. It, and, and for me it was extraordinary because that tie was seen by many as a dead rubber. They felt it was gone. I mean I talked it up sometimes as if Umberland they weren't showing anything and I think I think the second half was out of desperation. They they they, they couldn't do anything else more than just go for it and boy it was going for it was really well. Football is a funny thing because I feel like Humberland play 45 minutes of football while how have you played the other three half but how have you almost go home at Humble Lion almost it's how through. football is because <laughs> persons will say at times in football oh that team played better but football the coaches will tell you yeah. it's all about scoring yeah. goals almost, it's I'm, about scoring goals and you could kick it straight down the pitch and score that would be it how about so, you almost find himself out man. almost find himself out so that is that is all good that's why football is is such a lovely sport because you just don't know what could happen and it just takes a second for a goal to score i was quite pleased with umbland i think they could leave your holding their heads high um yes half of you went through deservingly in the end i felt but umbland must be proud and maybe that's a cue to tell them that next season play a little bit more on the front foot. Mount Pleasant made a statement. Mount Pleasant made a statement. But the thing is, they've always, they've always been kind of iffy in the playoffs. Good regular season, iffy playoffs, and you really don't know what, what you're going to expect from them when the postseason comes around. They're gonna have to play. Obviously, they're gonna have to play much better than this when they um, when they play Arnett in the semifinals. But it's good signs to show that maybe this is the year that they finally take the lead. Because obviously they, they get they get close, quarterfinals, semifinals, but if Coach Whitmore believes said that this is the time they need to make a statement, need to make a move, then maybe this is the year. Night again. Well I think um the guys wanted it um last week we were we were a bit in discipline. You know, this afternoon we know the task at hand, we know what is at stake. So everything we have to take into consideration, a semi-final bird. We get into the club championship, the CONCACAF club championship, so everything was at stake. Um, first half, I think we were a bit, you know, tentative, but um, I guess in the second half, we stepped up the pace and we took the game to the Dumbo Holding team. Well, we, we expect a tough um, game from the Arnett Garden team. We have, we, we have met twice this season, we have lost and draw, so we expect a, a tough game. We know it's going to be tough, so we just have to prepare ourselves both mentally, physically going into the game. We just continue to work. Um, 
is a tough task. A um, few months we, we keep working, so we just have to keep our eyes on the prize. I thought the Harbour View Humberland match was a very, very good match. I didn't expect Humberland to come on like that in the last four minutes of the, the second half and into the the last four minutes of the first half rather into the second half. Yeah, Humberland, you come on very, very well. Like, how up you're in for the money? I thought probably Harbour View felt like they were a bit comfortable. I don't know. So they probably drop off a bit. But yeah, man, Humberland, with them know they have to keep on your toe. You see me, Humberland come up with enough energy. Humberland run, them pass the ball, them move, and every time them attack them, look like them could have scored. You know, but Harbour View have to kind of reach back into the reserve there. I think probably part of the issue is that Harbour View was in the link up. You see me, so them kind of have to uh, use the energy on a Friday and then come here on a Monday. You know, and I think that probably caught up to them while Humberland is not in the link up, so them, they probably came full of energy and were ready to expound all that energy. Uh, overall, I thought the better team went through, but. You know, I always love to see entertaining football and I think that game was very, very, very entertaining.